Willow Signature by G.A. Joe Holmes. Let's talk high-end luxury in Port St. Lucie, Florida, specifically in tradition. I'm currently at Belterra by GHO Homes. You're looking at pure luxury at its finest. There will only be 300 homes built in here. Very high end. And currently, with an incentive, every home comes with a swimming pool. My name is Jonathan B.J. Hayes, local realtor here in beautiful Port St. Lucie, Florida. Thank you for returning back to the home of Port St. Lucie Real Estate. As always, make sure you subscribe to the channel, share the videos, like the videos, and tell a friend about the wonderful things going on here in beautiful Port St. Lucie, Florida. Anybody interested in selling or buying a home here in Port St. Lucie, all my information is in the description below. You can call or text me for your free one-on-one -on -one consultation. So today out here at Belterra, let me paint the picture for you guys. Tradition is beginning to expand. Belterra is located right off of 95. So Tradition as we currently know it has the town center over there by Riverland, all the other places where there's a lot of traffic, a lot of congestion. This thing has grown quickly. Now it's expanded to the other end to where the Amazon plant is, Cheney Brothers, and there are huge plans over here. Essentially what's gonna happen is you're getting a Starbucks over here, a Lowe's, a Wawa. There's gonna be a whole new town center built over here, an amphitheater, yes. Tradition in Port St. Lucie is growing very, very fast. So when you look over here now and you're like, ah, it doesn't look like much is going on. Not yet, but everything is in the works. And before you know it, you're going to see a little metropolis in front of your very eyes. So over here at Belterra, guys, it's just beautiful. It's more boutique. What you're going to take a look at today, it's on the higher end. Here's what I can tell you. I've seen the plans. You can get gorgeous houses in here, completely done. It almost looked like the model for 800 and up. Phase two, there's most likely won't be anything under a million dollars. So if you see something you like, let me know, make comments below, and let's take a look at what Belterra has to offer. Belterra in tradition, Port St. Lucie is where we are at home you are looking at is the Willow Signature. This is four beds, three and a half baths with a den, two car garage with a bay. That bay is used for a golf cart. Everybody has a golf cart out in tradition. Size of the house, 2,844 square feet. So it is a larger home. Asking price, this is is the price which includes the lot the swimming pool which as i mentioned the swimming pools are an incentive at this point it is their biggest selling feature they have price eight hundred and fifty four thousand nine hundred ninety dollars again guys i know it's a steep price point but the house does come with the pool absolutely gorgeous and i can tell you phase two these houses will be over a million dollars. Very boutique, only 300 houses going to be built in here. Couple things that really, really stand out to me as soon as you walk in, it's the high ceilings. So all the houses in Belterra, and specifically this one, they get no lower than ceiling height of 10 feet. The bedrooms are 10 feet foot ceilings, but a lot of them have an additional coffer space in them also. Really stuck out to me. In this particular home, you know, you'll see how high the ceilings are. They can range anywhere up to 14 feet. It's a very nice selling feature. Uh, most of the builders are going the opposite way, giving you less ceiling height because just they can save more money in concrete. Not here at Belterra. 
Also, obviously, as we talked, it's the pool. They're giving everybody a pool. Every home is going to come with a pool. Um, where the builder is going to try to make money is off these screen enclosures. They're going to give you different options of what you may want. Um, you know, it's going to be a regular sized pool. So it's not going to be, as I would call it, a little Weston waiter. It's going to be a regular size pool. Again, they're just going to try to make up the difference when it comes to what options you would like with that pool. So that's where you're going to stand on that. Other things I like. So when we first walked in, the big double door entry, man, it's awesome. That double door entry is just knock, knock out. The closets, you're not getting any more rack closets with them. So I know a lot of times you spend all this money and you get those white wire closets. They finally did something right. They are going to eliminate them. Everybody is going to get the wooden um, closet. So in all the videos you're going to see from over there, you're going to notice those wooden closets. That's standard. They did everything here. So here roughly between 6 to 10% of your purchase price is what you can upgrade the house at and it can be very comparable to a model. Most of the other builders to get the home to show like the model you're looking between 40 to 60% in upgrades if you're looking to do that. Now, as you know, the price is pretty steep. You're, you're looking at $800,000 just to get the ball game kicked off. But I will remind you, it does come with a swimming pool. So there are some great features. Those are some of the things that really stick out along with the walk-in closets. If you're a person that has a lot of clothes, shoes, you'll have places to... Uh, sit and change and do your makeup and all that so that's on that side of things so that's pricing guys let's talk about the the hoa situation so you know it's tradition nobody's a stranger to cdds their cdds roughly going to be between 15 to two thousand dollars just like the rest of them you're also going to be looking at as far as what comes with the hoa it's not going to be a huge clubhouse. They're going to have a smaller clubhouse, about 4,000 square feet. It's going to have a couple pickleball courts, big swimming pool, um, little area in the back. They're going to have like a dock um, so you can see out to um, the man-made lake they did. But it's not going to be anything crazy. If you're looking to play, you know, pickleball tournaments and all that, basically they're saying go somewhere else and do it. This is for people that want to live in opulence and housing. We're not going to specialize in um, pickleball tournaments and chorus concerts. Just being real, guys. Um, their mainstay is get a beautiful, large house with all the details with a swimming pool. That's us here at Belterra. So here we go. Let's look at some of their specs here. As far as the HOA, it is $470 a month right now. You know these things vary. They're only going to go up, but they're at four seventy a month. You're going to get the cable, um, the basic internet, security, um, lawn maintenance. They take care of all that. It's the same as all the others in tradition. Um, as far as the gate goes, everybody's getting away from the man-made gate. They're watch 24 7 everybody will have a fob to get through they'll know when somebody isn't supposed to be there and will be stopped um let's get down to brass tacks so here we go it's a gated community with a clubhouse pool fitness billiards entertainment area centralized mail and more tennis courts basketball pickleball tradition area lakes parks hospitals shopping easy access to i-95 and south GHO Community, GHO is a smart panel with one um, CAT6 data lines in the houses, wall-mounted TV packages, Wi-Fi enabled, Nest, Halo, video doorbell. Everything is smart home ready, guys. Construction features, you got double row steel, concrete bonded beam. Um, plywood is 5 eighths of an inch, so you're getting all at the top of the top of construction materials you will be getting here. Um, some of the other things I will touch on here for you, exterior features. So 
you know, everything's in packed glass, windows, doors. The other thing that is very nice is all of the sliders. They're all 10 foot sliders, which are all impact glass. You're going to get paver driveways and the walks also. Fiberglass raised eight panel front doors, which are impact with impact resistant um, glass. It's just going to be very, very nice. And even in the utility rooms, you're getting white shaker style uh, utility room cabinets. In the gourmet kitchens, you're getting the kitchen cabinets, dovetail drawers, soft clothes. The kitchen cabinets feature crown molding, glass doors, granite or quartz countertops with four inch backsplashes, LED und undermount cabinet lighting in the kitchen, Whirlpool dishwashers, uh, glass cooktops if you would like. Let's talk bathroom, luxury bathroom. So you're gonna have the raised height bath vanity cabinets quartz or granite in the bathroom also and in the interior you're going to have eight foot two panel interior doors crown molding in the living areas den dining room master 10 foot sliding glass doors in the great room again a lot of the things that most of the builders have been charging for upgrades they're just putting it in so they can get as close as possible to what you see in the model in closing guys it is on the higher end and the higher spectrum that's what this community is all about they're really not looking for first-time home buyers they're really not looking for people just looking to squeak in they're looking for the buyer who wants a beautiful home and they're ready to build it for you if you have any questions or would like your personal own guided tour by me, all my information is below. Feel free to contact.